the 5-9 Kihei Clark. That shot gets caught. Anthony baseline leading in, got the pass off, but tangled up and taken away by the Cavaliers. Two games you can watch here tonight on the network. The number three, Louisville, coming up later. Diakite off a great find from Will the Tensai. And it's not that like they played a bunch of schleps this year. They're 9-1, and one, and the only team that's really taken to the woodshed offensively has been Purdue at Purdue. Will the Tensai find Statman and a big three there. 9-48, which was their only game in a 22-day span. Well, to Tensai on the drive as he fades across the lane and scores. He's got all five for Virginia. 45-26 inside of 12 minutes to go in the second half. Another three for Virginia. Now numbers for UVA. The lob for Hoff, who reciprocates with a dunk at the other end. Four games live in February of 2017 and hoping to rectify those couple L's on their schedule. Well, the Tensai banks in the three, the first of the night for UVA. Well, Tensai shoots 28% from three. Two of nine from three for Syracuse. Braxton Key nearly lost it. He sends it across the court, eight to go. And will the Tensai with his third three of the game. Timeout Virginia. Baseline, but it's a drive from Gray to open it up with the defense fully committing. Kia Clark trying to make something happen. Five on the timer. Wold to Tensai throws up a three. Diakite, left open. He'll make you pay. Throughout his career, which sets up Walden Tensai's probing dribbles for the mid-range jumper from Diakite. If you're Georgia Tech, do you continue the foul? Yeah, at this point, you got to. No-look pass. Jay Huff rocks the rim. Players have at least put themselves in a position to return to the NCAA tournament. I think it's too early to be talking bubble at this point as that one's knocked down. Hold a 10 side of 6-5. June was selling the game, locked up on the baseline. Shot clock down to five. Hold a 10 side. Will hit that one, a three-pointer. Cavaliers finding a little bit of rhythm, dare I say, from the outside. Hold a 10 side. Dials it down. She started in very good shape, 7-0. and oh. As you mentioned, as we came on the air, they dropped four out of five, but they're starting to get this guy going. Hold a 10 side. Again. Clark with a pass off and the basket once again by the hottest man on the floor for the Cavaliers. On the 10 side, baseline again. Got airborne. Here's up from the corner. Got it! He nails the three. Virginia by one. Out of respect, Walton Tensai from three. He attacks the Musius closeout, draws three defenders, and Huff, the 31% three point shooter. It goes. All points and 10 rebounds. Kite off the bait. That's a three-pointer on the 10th side. You can't sag off him. Sar needs to have an awareness. Or excuse me, that's Torrey Johnson. He needs to have an awareness of him. You cannot play off. Well, one, two, two, look. On the 10th side drive, kicks it out. Diakite going to try another three. You made baskets, but what you should be focused on is the fact that you gave up a dribble drive. The dribble drive getting beat. Which is it's worked for them. They're yes. a little different uh, than they were last year with fewer offensive weapons. Diakite feeling it. Yes. Battle situation. The dribble drive creates open shot opportunities. He got the two early fouls. And Scott is out there now. Wilton Tensai. Biggest discrepancy between three-point shooting and three-point defense in the country, meaning they get the most value from the three-point line of anybody. I Leonard in him right there, huh? <laughs> well, the 10 side. Whoa. That one's good. Boy, that was good defense, too. McMahon looked over at Chris Mack and raised his hand like... Massive possession right here. Feels like, anyway. Yeah, Virginia lingering in this yeah. game within nine... Rolled a 10 side for three at six. AC Morsell, the freshman. Oh. Rolled a 10 side. Man. Found his shot again. And Williamson just got lost by a great cut by Walden Tensai. It's a sweet, I'm telling you. Uh, see how he set him up at the bottom and Williamson couldn't get out? That's good basketball. Didn't do anything. 
two. Well, the tenth side found a shot and scored it again. It's a two. He's got four from that spot in this half. What's this? Here it comes right. That was the last two right minutes across the lane. And then he takes a dribble right afternoon in Louisville. Mm -hmm. it's, it's number 53. He's going to get one other side. Well, the tenth side. Bullseye again. I honestly don't know how you can get that shot. Are you kidding me? Well, the tenth side again. Has the tie. Oh, my gosh. It's a Rembrandt for him. The studio art major continues to pepper the basket. New line, the new line, and when you take that difference into consideration, many guys all throughout the season have been taking that retreat step, stepping on that line. But for Walter Tenzai, who did not step out of bounds, the nice turnaround for the comes much more close to the basket. Braxton Key, back rim, and grabs his own mix. Hub had started to leak out for the Irish. Rolled to Tensai. Has the first five for Virginia. Rolled to Tensai. Found Diakite from the short corner. And he's going to the free throw. They told us it doesn't take him long to substitute in that second half. He's going to start the same way. Three for Kihei. 7 to 10 on the road at Louisville last week. Tell you what, he gets going. Good block, saved by Key. Hold the ten side. Oh, boy. Hold the ten side. Gets another. And that was set up by Clark. 10.3 to go, Virginia down a point. P.A. Clark, who's lightning quick. Clark, looking for space. To the corner, while the tenth side got it. Wow! Oh, what a big shot, and he's hit him all night. Oh man, that's his spot. Left. He kept his dribble. Why you're helping? I don't know. Why you're leaving your feet, I don't know. And Walden Tensai gets a great look from his favorite spot. All six field goals tonight from three-point range. How good was that shot in front of 20,000? Did not play in the last mass up matchup against Virginia and will not play tonight because of the back spasms. Yes, yeah, suffered back spasms today at shoot around and just couldn't go. Jay Huff. See a lot of that tonight because both these teams offensively are going to take it late to the clock. Mm. Oh, it's inside. Let's see hanging around a little bit here. Lee was 12 with a breakdown to eight. What a 10 side. Speaking of Coach Jeff Capel before this game, he said, look, we need to do that right there. Try to get out in the passing lanes and then try to get some transition offense off the of turnover. Well, the 10 side guarded by Couture, and as he Cuts to the basket, he finds Clark, who loads up for three in the corner. Just a little breakdown. A few players go with the basketball, baseline drive, baseline. Mike Cousins, John Crispin, thanks for being with us tonight here in Blacksburg. LSU and Florida will follow in the SEC tonight. Key waits it out and gets the bucket, no whistle. Maryland, Kansas, and Duke, the three teams that all have two wooden award late season top 20 players. As Jay Huff connects from the corner. I watch this guy. Here we go. That's the best. Look at the guy. Oh, he knows where his teammate wide open. Some pressure for Kihei Clark to deal with. Nice post up move. On the 10 side with the lob. Oh, and Jay Huff oh, my with God. the finish. No, that was clear 101. There's the post up, the Katie. Goes opposite. And there's the diagonal pass. The lob. The layup.